In this video, I'll show you how to set up a shipment tracking for your WooCommerce store for free. Let's get straight into it. We'll allow customers to review their tracking information on orders details page. So for example, here, we can see that this particular order has been shipped by DHL and here it's listing a dispatch date and also providing us with the tracking code in which when we click on this link here, we can go ahead and track the particular order. In the back end, the admin will have this new option to enable order tracking where they can enter in the tracking code entering the courier name and also the pickup date and also the link to where the customers can track the particular order if you want to create a similar setup on your woocommerce store we'll be using the free version of the yif order tracking plugin i'll leave a link in the description below and with that being said let's head over to our dashboard the first thing we're going to do is install and activate the yif order tracking plugin so we just go plugins add new and we'll search for order shipment tracking and it's this particular one here so we'll install and activate this plugin all right, and now we can go ahead and configure this plugin. So we'll head over to Yif and then order and shipment tracking. Okay, so we can add a default carrier. All right, so we could say, for example, DHL. So here we can customize the messaging shown on the order details page. So let's have a quick look at what this is referring to now. All right, when we view this particular order, we can see the tracking information on this orders page. Okay, so we can show it below the product detail or even above the product detail. Okay, so this is that message and we can customize the messaging as well. So it dynamically includes the courier name, the pickup date, and also the tracking code as well with a link over to the courier website. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave mine at the bottom of the product list, so that's fine. If you do go for the premium version, then you'll have some additional option to display this information in the customer's order confirmation email all right and that looks like this here okay so this is what it looks like so they'll have their order information and then they'll also have their tracking information here with the estimated date as well so you'll get all this in a premium version whereas it's not possible in the free version so let's save our settings here and then let's go ahead and test this out so let's head over to um, orders and let's say this particular order here let's edit this one and then let's enable our order tracking. So here we can enter in a tracking code. Okay. And then we can add the courier name. So we can say DHL and then we can set the pickup date. All right. And then we'll also add the website link here. Okay. Okay. So for the website link, I'm going to send customers directly over to the tracking URL. You can send them to the homepage as well. It's totally up to you, but I think this is a much more user-friendly experience. So here they can just enter in their tracking number. So let's paste in our URL here and then we can just update the order. Okay. So now when a customer actually logs into their account, they'll be able to see the tracking information. So let's quickly test this out. Go on my account and let's go orders. And then here we can see this tracking option. All right. So when we hover over it, we've got this tracking information here. So it's letting us know it's been shipped by DHL and when it's been picked up and also the tracking code. If we click on this track button, it'll open up the courier website. So then the customer can just enter in their tracking number. If you wanted to streamline the user experience, then you might want to consider going for the pro version because then when a customer clicks on this tracking link, it'll automatically take them over to this tracking page with the tracking number already entered, right? So it's just a much more streamlined user experience. So let's quickly head back over to our admin area. Let's go orders. Okay. And here it's just like in a customer's front end, right? So at a glance, the admin can see the status of this particular order. So this is super handy for whoever's dealing with phone support or even email support or customers ringing up with regards to their order. Whoever's managing it can just quickly at a glance see, well, it's been dispatched by X company on this particular date and the order number is X. All right. So that's how you can add a shipment tracking in your WooCommerce store for free now let's have a quick look at the difference between the free and the pro version all right so some of the key difference is in the pro version you'll get access to over 480 couriers with the option to automatically send customers the tracking url right that will take them directly to the tracking page we can also import the tracking code via csv that's in the pro version okay and you can also set an estimated delivery date in the pro version as well Another standout feature is in the pro version, you can automatically send customers an email with their tracking details once the order has been completed. Like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave in a comment box.